Polaris, the North's Tsar's mysterious fate, is it about to vanish forever? For thousands of years, Polaris, the North's Tsar, has been a steady, guiding presence in the night sky. It has served as a cosmic compass, always pointing north, a symbol of stability and guidance for ancient navigators, astronomers, and dreamers alike. But now, something strange is happening. Changes are unfolding, quietly, mysteriously, right above our heads. Polaris is acting. Different. Its behavior has become unpredictable. And scientists are beginning to worry. Is the North Star dying? Could it vanish from our skies within a few decades, or has it already exploded, and we simply don't know it yet? This is the story of Polaris. A star at the center of human history. Now possibly nearing the end of its life. The star that doesn't move located in the constellation Ursa Minor, Polaris holds a near magical position in the sky, it sits almost exactly above Earth's rotational north pole. This alignment means that while other stars appear to rotate around the sky throughout the night, Polaris remains almost completely still, like the hub at the center of a spinning wheel. This made it incredibly important for ancient seafarers and land explorers. Long before GPS or maps, Polaris was used to determine direction, estimate latitude, and navigate vast oceans and deserts. For people in the Northern Hemisphere, Polaris became the ultimate point of reference. To many cultures, it wasn't just a star, it was a symbol. A cosmic anchor. A metaphor for constancy, truth, and trust. But that could be about to change. A star with secrets while Polaris looks like a single shining light in the night sky, it's actually part of a complex triple star system. At its heart is Polaris A, a yellow-white supergiant star. Orbiting close to it is a smaller companion called Polaris Ab, and a little farther out is Polaris B, which was first discovered in 1780. These three stars interact with each other gravitationally, affecting their orbits, brightness, and internal dynamics. Polaris A is massive, about five times the mass of our Sun, and much more luminous. As a supergiant, it's already in a late stage of stellar evolution. Stars like Polaris don't stay stable forever. After shining for millions of years, they begin to change rapidly, sometimes ending in violent, spectacular explosions known as supernovae. This might be where Polaris is headed. The light we see is centuries old. Here's something mind bending. Polaris is 323 light years away from Earth. That means the light we see from Polaris tonight actually left the star over 300 years ago. When you gaze up at the North Star, you're seeing it as it looked in the early 1700s, long before the invention of electricity, cars, or modern science. So if something dramatic has already happened, say, a supernova, we wouldn't know about it until centuries later. It's entirely possible that Polaris already exploded. And we just haven't received the light from that event yet. Disturbing new observations in recent years, astronomers have noticed something unusual, Polaris is no longer behaving the way it used to. Historically, Polaris has been known to slightly pulse, its brightness rising and falling over a regular cycle, caused by rhythmic changes in its outer layers. But recently, this cycle has become erratic and unpredictable. The period of pulsation has lengthened by about 4.5 seconds, a subtle shift, but one that alarms astronomers. This increase may suggest internal instability, possibly driven by gravitational interactions with its companion stars. Some scientists suspect that Polaris is rapidly evolving, a sign that it may be a pro Polaris vs. Betelgeuse, a cosmic comparison Polaris isn't the only famous star acting strange. In 2019, another giant star, Betelgeuse, located in the Orion constellation, suddenly dimmed in brightness. The world watched closely. 
Many astronomers thought Betelgeuse was about to explode in a dramatic supernova. Although that didn't happen, at least, not yet, the incident reminded us how little we truly understand about the final stages of stellar life. Polaris is now showing its own kind of warning signs. While NASA and other space agencies have been closely monitoring Betelgeuse, Polaris has remained under the radar, despite exhibiting similarly strange behaviors. What happens if Polaris explodes? If Polaris were to go supernova, it would be an awe-inspiring event. For days or even weeks, the star could outshine everything else in the night sky, possibly even visible during daylight hours. It could briefly rival the moon in brightness. Colors might shift, white, blue, red, as the star ejects its outer layers and collapses in on itself. Then, eventually, it would fade. Gone. The constellations that we know, especially Ursa Minor, would never look the same again. The North Star would vanish, taking with it thousands of years of tradition, myth, and practical value. Are we in danger? Thankfully, no. At 323 light years away, Polaris is too far to pose any real threat to Earth. Even a massive supernova wouldn't cause harm here. No deadly radiation, no gravitational disruption. It would be, essentially, a visual spectacle, a powerful reminder of the scale, and majesty of the universe. What would change for humanity? The disappearance of Polaris would be felt deeply, not just by astronomers, but by sailors, hikers, and anyone who uses the sky to navigate. The loss of a stable northern reference point would force a rethinking of navigation tools, both old and new. Scientific instruments that rely on fixed stellar coordinates would need recalibration. New stars might need to be used for alignment. Culturally, the loss of Polaris would leave a symbolic gap. It would mark the end of an era. Stories, traditions, and mythologies tied to the North Star would take on new meaning, perhaps seen as a completed chapter in humanity's relationship with the cosmos. The bigger picture stars are not eternal. They are born, they live, and they die. What we're seeing with Polaris might just be the final act in a stellar life that began millions of years ago. But in its fading, Polaris may still serve a purpose. It can teach us more about how stars evolve, how binary and triple star systems interact, and how the universe is constantly changing, even when it appears still. This is not just about the North Star. It's about understanding that nothing in the universe lasts forever, not even the brightest and most dependable points of light. Final thoughts We don't know exactly what's going to happen to Polaris. It might stabilize again. It might continue to dim. Or it may already be gone, its fate sealed centuries ago, with the light of its final moments still racing across the cosmos toward us. What we do know is this, the night sky is alive. Changing. Full of mysteries. As we continue to watch Polaris and stars like it, we remain students of the universe, forever looking up, forever learning. Thank you for joining us on this cosmic journey. If you want more fascinating space stories and stellar updates, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon.